Let's get going. Okay, you ready? This is our plate glass right here. It's so it's a piece of like three mil Sintra. Three mil Sintra. To represent the glass. And our glass. Okay. Place it on here. We knew we kind of wanted a little bit of extra beef around it. So this is the backing plate of our carrier. Then we needed a holder for it. So we cut out a 10 by 12 with a 10, 8 by 10 on the inside. So there's an inch on each side. It carries, that goes around the glass negative. Then we needed a spacer to move the dark slide off of the glass so it doesn't touch the emulsion. So we cut a 10 by 12 again, but this time it's a three uh, three quarter inch. Uh, so that it's back off so of the off, off the glass. Off the glass as well. Yeah, this was the trickiest part right here. All right, leave it on the table for a second, and then I'll. Because you can, that way you can kind of see how it's now. Go ahead and separate it. So it started out as an 11 by 12 piece. And you slightly and we cut it out so that it stays glass. in. The dark slide is not going to come all the way out of the. Uh, it's not going to come all the way out of the film back. And you slide it back in when you're done. And then our final piece, which is a one inch, 10 by 12, all the way around. It goes on top of everything. And there you have your finished homemade film carrier. And then uh, just to demonstrate, you'll pull the dark slide out. And as you do, you can see the white being revealed. That's the 8x10 piece of glass. And then when you're done with your exposure, you slide this back in. And then the whole this whole piece... We'll, once it gets all glued together around the edges, we'll slide down into the back of the uh, of the Sintra camera. So next up is uh, the camera stuff.